The Milwaukee Admirals return home tonight to take on the Grand Rapids Griffins at the BMO Harris Bradley Center. After the game, country act Parmalee will perform in a live post-game concert. Tonight is Milwaukee's first home game since January the 9th. The Admirals have played just four games in the interim, winning three and losing one in overtime. So a 3 one and 0 mark over the last couple of weeks for the Admirals. Last weekend, the Admirals were in Cleveland to take on the Lake Erie Monsters. They lost one game in overtime. The second game, they win one nothing. Mark Mazinitz with a shutout in that contest. Stephen Elliott scored both Admirals goals over the weekend in Cleveland. Tomorrow, the AHL will break for the annual All-Star Classic in Syracuse, New York. The skills competition is tomorrow night, 7 o'clock Central on Time Warner Cable Sports 32. And then the game is Monday at 6 p.m. again on Time Warner Cable Sports 32. Admirals head coach Dean Evison will lead the Central Division All-Stars, and one of his players will be Admirals leading scorer Frederick Goudreau. So you leave for the All-Star game after the game tonight against Grand Rapids. So what uh, do you have any idea what what is in store for you once you get into Syracuse? I have no idea. No, they haven't told me anything. So of all the events, and they have the accuracy, and you have speed, and you have uh, accuracy, uh, the quick shot, all of that stuff, what, do you have any events that you would like to do? Honestly, I don't really care. I'm just going to try to have fun there. Um, I'm only going there for the experience, and like I said, just to have fun. So. Any of them, I'll, uh, I'll enjoy it for sure. It'll be neat, I suppose, to meet, and we've talked about this before, the Central Division teammates because you guys, the Admirals play such a heavy Central Division schedule. It's easy to find enemies on the other team. Yeah. Now it's going to be neat to, to find them on the other side, right? Yeah, for sure. Um, but that's the way hockey is. Uh, you're not friend on the ice, but after that, I mean, once we'll get to know each other, I'm sure that we'll get, uh, get to, uh, to have a good chemistry. Have you ever played in something like this before? Uh, no, I think it's my first time. Yeah. Okay. So mm -hmm. you don't you you don't really have a, a ton of experience of landing, <laughs> getting and getting right to the rink and and meeting new guys and all of that stuff. It's uh, it's it's something new. Yeah, it's gonna be the first time. It's gonna be fun for sure. Is there anything you're looking forward to in particular? Uh, honestly, I know the schedule a little bit, um, but I don't know it exactly. So I'm just gonna do what I have to do, and for sure. Uh, put my focus on just enjoying uh, what what's happening. That's the big thing, right? I mean, there, there might be some incentive to win, but the big thing is it's an exhibition, right? It's three on three. You're going to get tired out there probably. Yeah, it's exactly. it's just to have fun. Exactly, yeah, for sure. Um, I think that's the focus for everyone. And uh, it's, it's going to be a big weekend, like you said, we're playing tonight. And then I got to leave tomorrow and then uh, the game on Monday. So I'm just going to... Like I said, just going to try to have fun. Do you think your head coach will be uh, real intense about this? I don't know. You should ask him. <laughs> <laughs> we'll find out. Yeah. Let's talk about tonight's game against Grand Rapids. Uh, they've stumbled a little bit, but they've had your number this season. Um, and you guys have struggled a bit lately getting those five-on-five -five goals. How do you how do you crank it up here tonight? I think we had a great week of practice. Uh, the L for sure. I mean, it's just another game, um, another important game. We just got to play it the other way. Mm. Uh, no matter who's uh, who's on the other side, and uh, I think that's what we're going to try to do tonight. Is there any other? Is there any added pressure knowing this is the last game going into the All Star break with when you, you've had such a light schedule lately? Uh, no, no pressure. I, I would say it's just uh, for sure we want to win it like every other game. But like you said, uh, it's one game this week, and then it's the break. So uh, I think everybody wants to go. Uh, for the win for sure. The last couple of weeks it's been two games and a break, two games and a break, one game now yeah. and a break. We've talked so much about the importance of practice. Are you, are you guys ready to go and say let's play some games now? Oh yeah for sure we had a good week practice. Uh, you know when you only play uh, in five days or, or in a week or so um, you get more time to, to take care of your body and all that. And that's what we did this week so for sure we're ready to go. Excellent. Good luck tonight. Thank you very much. That's Frederick Adro. Face off tonight between the Admirals and Griffins at 7 o'clock. Pre-game coverage starting at 6.30 on Sports Radio 105.7 FM, The Fan. Again, country act Parmalee will perform in a live post-game concert brought to you by Coors Light and FM 106.1. The Admirals can be seen online, ahllive.com. For more information about tonight's game or upcoming events, go to milwaukeeadmirals.com.